RIP. We're here at Pro Light and Sound in Frankfurt 2024, and I'm here with Mark Wadsworth. Hello, Mark. Hey, how's it going? Very good. Tell me a bit more about digital projection. Okay, so we actually invented DLP projectors 30 something years ago now. Um, and we've always been at the forefront of projection from the very first projectors to the very first three tip laser projectors, still, still, still coming up with brand new technology from 8K to our satellite modular laser system. We've always tried to push the boundaries of what's possible within projection technology. And you're very well known for that, and across the different sort of verticals, whether it's live events, military applications, all kinds of uh, education as well. Um, tell me about new products. What are you, what's looking, you know, what's that looking like? So we introduced our satellite system um, a couple of years ago, which is new. That's still one of the most revolutionary products on the market. But recently we've updated our whole electronics platform for our integrated projectors. So like you'll see up here with the e-vision projectors that we've got, everything from the very high end Titan straight down to the more entry level e-visions, they have our new Nexus electronics platform. What that allows us to do is it gives a set of building blocks for every projector we've got. So no matter what you buy, you're using the same control protocol, you've got the same OSD, you know how to set it up. It's all about making life easy for the customers. You know, there used to be an arms race to the brightest or highest resolution, but you know, th there's a limit to that. People don't need 60, 70, 80,000 lumens. It's about making their life easier, putting software in there, putting interact in their connectivity in there that is going to make their life when they're setting it up and running it easier. I want to ask you about that connectivity piece, yeah. especially because we're doing AV over IPOE. Of and of course, you guys have do you know known for doing the HG Base C uh, cards. Is there anything on the pipeline in terms of IP? Yeah, absolutely. So, like I said, we have our our new Nexus Electronics platform in there, and that's give us the building blocks to do modular things. So, yes, we have it on the roadmap. I can't say exactly what that is at this moment in time, but because of the new Nexus platform, the building blocks are in place, and it's up to us to make the decision then what and when. And if I'm not wrong, those building blocks are what I really liked about your satellite system, because you've really thought that out where you've got, let's say, the, the heavy power somewhere else, and you're able to kind of pipe that in with with what you and, and that's what you're talking about the modular aspect is that right well that's the modular aspect of the projectors but within the whole electronics platform and um, talk about the modularity of option cards okay. so if we wanted to put a signal path into our current electronics platform we can do we've built that capability as well um, so that's where i'm talking about the modularity for the integrated projectors ryan i want to bring you in here one thing that was interesting to us is, is obviously the integration, the part about working together, you know, in terms of solution partners. And one of the things that these guys are doing here is working with the software. Do you want to ask the question about the software part? So I think the thing that's intriguing me is if we look up here, we've got two projectors. Yep. And the obvious thing here is how do you get such a seamless image okay. in the background there? So, I mean, you, you, can, you can do this internally within the projectors, you can do it externally with software. What we're doing here is we're working with Vioso. So we've worked with them for many years um, on projects in real life as well as on trade shows. Um, they've got some of the most advanced warp and blend on the planet. Um, and by working with partners like Vioso, it allows us to increase our offering, enhance our built-in warp and blend, uh, to, like you said, create that completely seamless image that you can see. Um, especially when you're looking at pixel-based camera alignment. You know, these guys have got that software, they've got the capability. We use it within our projectors, um, and it allows us to create beautiful, seamless, massive large canvases. Perfect. And I say, I say we've only got the two uh, two projectors up here being merged today. Yeah. But you're saying about large canvases, so I take it then if you'd like a large dome area, etc., you could, you could fill that and align the projectors very, very easily. Absolutely. I mean, we, we, we couldn't a dome or even a building you know we can be talking anything from two three channels all the way up to it's, you can get up to 30 40 channels no problem um, and so long as you've got the camera alignment and the software to do it you can very quickly and easily set up a, a, a big seamless display um, in a way that used to take you know manually take hours and hours of time to do so it's important that we're working with people like the also uh, to allow us to do this of course, that reduces the amount of time people are on the project, you know, making it a lot easier to be able to do the installations. 
you know, the quicker that they can install and troubleshoot, the you know, the, the, the quicker that they can get around the project and complete it. And recalibration as well, let's not forget about that, you know, projectors move, buildings move where they're mounted, uh, you've got thermals, they get warm, they get cold, slight movements. When you're using the software like the Vioso Auto Calibration, then you can recalibrate at the press of a button using the cameras and the uh, the warp maps that you've already got set up. So it really it really does make life for installation just to maintenance a lot more straightforward. Lovely, thank you a lot. Thanks, Mark. Thanks for calling by, okay. appreciate it. That's all. Absolutely. It's a <laughs>